Alright, here it is guys, PewDiePie here, welcome back to the New Account Experience, this is episode 4. Uh, when we last left off, for those that missed it, ooh, another pet egg, hell yeah. Uh, for those that missed it, last episode we maxed our decks uh, and got a T4 spell. So we're very close to Hall's Rex now, basically all we need to do is, uh, preferably max our speed, I can technically do Hall's with 40. Oh, I didn't pick up the egg because my inventory is full. Nice. Technically I can run Hall's with 40 speed. Uh, I'm gonna choose not to. Uh, by the way, I'm going in the smaller realm because the other one is just uh, it's a it's a fresh realm, uh, and no one's at the Godlands yet. Uh, I'll go back in there a little bit just to look for crystal. Oh, I should have waited for someone else to come in here. All right, whatever. Yeah. So this episode we are going to go max speed and then hopefully get ourselves a T10 or a T11 staff because uh, then we'd be able to do halls. Uh, depending on how quickly it takes me to max speed. Uh, which I'm hoping it won't take terribly long. I only need 11 more. Um, depending on how quickly that goes and how long it takes us to get a T10 staff, uh, we could be looking at our first Halls runs today. Uh, I'm thinking about starting with Colts uh, because I have to be the one to lead them most likely unless someone else happens to be leading. Uh, there won't be much in the way of commentary when we get to the cult. If I'm the one leading, it'll just be uh, at the very end of the boss or if something happens, like if I get Cuffs or Garments. Cuffs would be good. Cuffs are better than Expo, uh, so I'd be very happy if I got them. The Perfect Spell Bomb, by the way, did a lot for my damage right there, uh, so that was good to have. Um, Rock Dragon, no, no, I don't think that'd be a good idea to go to that. Rock Dragon's fucking dangerous. Uh, I'm close enough on defense, I said 15, but you know what, one less damage is honestly not that big of a, de uh, of a deal. Uh, the rest of our stats are pretty close. I could sell snake pits honestly at this point, but uh, I prefer not to. I will if I have to, you know, yeah, whatever, it doesn't really matter. As long as I hit at least one perfect spell bomb, a lot of these things go by pretty quickly. I don't even have to. Oh, wow. Nice. Nice priest. Hopefully my priest goes something like that. I'm trying to go for 100% PPE. Uh, I've got this whole, like, realm my list where I literally just go through on a lot of my PPEs and uh, make a list of everything that I can get. Um, some are better than others. Mystic's really short. It's only about 26 items. Uh, Priest is a really long one. A lot of tomes. Uh, Priest is kind of a nightmare. But, uh, I don't know. Uh, I'm excited to do Priest. I'm excited to work on it for Puberty. Uh, when I get to Priest for Yard Sale, obviously I'm not going for that sort of 100% deal. Uh, I'm just kind of... just. I'm just going to at least try and hit 8-8 and be satisfied with that. Oh, he's back. Good. Um, if I end up getting a lot more than, ex if I end up like doing fungals and getting fungal tome, that would be incredible. I don't intend on it. Uh, for this character, depending on how far it gets, I might do shatters for ASP and, uh, I might also go for, um, the parasite spell. The parasite spell is more likely to happen than ASP because, uh, first off, par uh, uh, ASP isn't very useful. It's not a very good spell anymore. Uh, and um, also, I just need uh, Parasites to max mana. Uh, technically, yes, so do Shatters, but I don't really think that's going to happen. So, I mean, you just don't get shit from Shatters anymore. Or, well, frankly, ever. So, I think it's uh, much more beneficial. I'm going to switch realms now and probably pop this pet egg. It's much more beneficial to um, just go for Parasites for maxing mana because I also get the added bonus of... Uh, Hopefully getting attack for a decoy electric, not useful. I'm keeping all these common eggs. I'm not going to release them quite yet uh, because I have the rare. Uh, and I want to see if I can eventually uh, get myself a legendary pet, which would be really great. Uh, the rare is a nice little boost toward that. Magic Woods, hell yeah. Uh, this can be my staff, if I'm lucky. It's a massive rip to my accuracy. But, uh, oh, my archer PPU is kind of similar to that. Uh, the other guys. I, need a, I still need to edit that. No, not right now. I'm gonna probably shift this more towards solo episodes. Uh, I mean, I, it's just kind of a personal thing, and I think um, there hasn't really been a major difference so far between uh, uh, the feedback on personal and or private or uh, solo and uh, larger episodes. Uh, so I don't know. Um, I'm recording this 
not entirely back to back with, but about an hour and a half to two hours after I record the third one. So I don't really have any time to look at any of the comments or anything on that. Uh, but the first two, uh, as I said earlier, seem to be doing really well in terms of just view count. Uh, I hope that it kind of progresses like that. Whenever I've done series before, it's been kind of different with games like Terraria. Uh, where when I whenever I do Terraria, when I did Calamity Death Mode, um, first couple ones got about a thousand each. Uh, but this is when Death Mode was still moderately new, so people were like a lot of people were really interested in it. And then it kind of fizzled out over the series. And by the time I got to uh, Supreme Calamity, so I was only netting in about 150 to 200 views per episode, and I'm just kind of worried that the same thing's going to happen here. Uh, I'm still not entirely sure. Maxing speed's going by a lot faster than I thought it would. It's only been about six minutes. Uh, century. Hmm. Oh! Ooh! This could be good. I should probably also go for Tunnel Rat. I should get as many fame bonuses as I can. I hope Minty gets a Leaf Bow. I hope so. Maddie boy. I want to get to the point, uh, I've said this before as a joke, uh, but I want to get to the point where people don't, like, people see me in the realm, they don't call me puberty, they just call me Matt. <laughs> I don't know, I think that'd be interesting. I'm not really sure why. Alright, uh, let's hope for either life, uh, 25 attack to max is pretty good. Um, let's hope for life pots or, oh, that's annoying. This boss needs to be immune to stasis. It's probably an accident, though. Oh, close. Damn it. You gave me two T10s? Are you fucking kidding me? Magic Woods. Oh, there. Magic Woods are fucking dangerous. I swear to God. Rushing these is kind of sketch. Glad I don't have to. I really want this ninja skin, by the way. It looks really fucking good. Uh, if I happen to get skins on this account, that'd be pretty great. I might start farm some events simply for skins. Normally what I do for events, what I've started doing, is if I get, if like for this tomb event, I've drank virtually no life potions on my priest from it. The only thing I, the only time I drink is if I got something valuable, uh, on screen, and like if there's another life pot, I'd be like, alright, just to kind of keep with the fairness of it, uh, because I hate when people farm events and just get the easy max. Bloody cloak time? it. So you mean to tell me, by the way, that I've done four avatars and I haven't gotten a tablet? Honestly, pathetic. Uh, yeah, I almost died. Okay. Yeah, but I mean, I'm really offended right now because I've done four avatars and you know us realm players like our instant gratification. This is a really dangerous phase, by the way. Ooh, nice dodge. Uh, Want to get good at dodging? Either do Supreme Calamitous on death mode from Calamity, or do Voids with very little defense and no pet. You get real good real fast, or you just shit the bed. Uh, give me two speed, one defense. I think you can only actually get a maximum of two pots, so give me speed death. That'd be kind of nice. The uh, rest of my stats are somewhat close to max, the uh, rest of my rainbow stats anyways. Um, so hopefully... We, we at least 6-8. I, I want to be able to do better than the first one. Sweet. Oh, uh, well. It's something. Yeah, I want to do... The first one got 4-8, and I even used an event, so that's kind of sad. Uh, died to fucking... Was it Marble Defender? I swear I think I died to Marble Defender. Which is really kind of embarrassing. Uh, no, I don't think... No, I died in the Void. I'm thinking about... Like, one of the first wizard people... Oh, lab. Ooh. Lab robe would be sick. Uh, I'm thinking about, like, one of the... It's a PP... It's a wizard PP that I uploaded. That was way too many people. I was way too busy with talking. Um, I died to Marble Defender 6-8. This was back before I could, like, 8-8 PPEs on my own. And I was like, oh my god, you know, I'm, like, 6-8. I'm just now running Colts. Colts are an easy way to get life. And I was really excited for it. And then... See ya. Just fucking drop dead to Defender because I uh, went in too late and I just wasn't paying attention. So that was annoying. Uh, there are three priests, three wizards in here. Uh, okay. Shit. I honestly can't remember if this is one of the dungeons that HP scales. Uh, I I'm pretty sure it does because like during massive events, Jesus Christ. During massive events, uh, it takes longer to kill. I think almost all dungeons HP scale. Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, you'd have to fact check me on that. 
<laughs> I know how to confuse control. Oh god, I swear, I swear I know how to confuse control. Uh, I just don't really use it too often. In halls, when I get confused, I stop moving. Uh, just out of panic. Um, why in cellars, I get confused, press D to go forward. Uh, any other time, I don't know, I just kind of flail absentmindedly. Uh, and it works, honestly. Uh, that little strategy has uh, gotten me through many a confusions. <laughs> Labro would be really nice. Uh, Labro but Astral would be like big sex, uh, but I don't think it's going to happen. Alright, let's see what we get. Time to get a mark. I'll take it. I'm not going to waste my time going for a second. That'll take too long. We have business to discuss, gentlemen. Crystal? What? Nope. Alright, five, five speed to go. Uh, honestly, speed doesn't matter. Uh, like if we're gonna we're gonna max speed really quickly here. Uh, gotta get <laughs> better uh, staff. Honestly, what I might do for the sake of time is just for this video because I, I really want to get Colton now that we've maxed our uh, speed so quickly. Is I will literally just pause until we get a um, a better staff. I'm only about ten minutes into the episode. Uh, so that's good. We can definitely max in the next uh, next little segment. We can max pretty quickly, uh, and then save the latter half of the episode, like the second half of it, for getting a uh, better staff. <laughs> I appreciate your philanthropy, even if you fucked yourself over, nerd. Got him. Tier rooms are nice. I really like the fact that most dungeons have a tier room. Uh, UDL one is just kind of interesting. It's not common, which is good. I would hate it if it was like a really common tier room. Uh, so it's good that it's just kind of a pleasant little surprise that you happen to walk up on. I'm waiting for Steno specifically to give me the T10 staff. That's what I'm hoping for. I know it can happen. Uh, and now I'm just waiting for it to happen. <laughs> Alright. Doing these with other people is so nice. Like I was listening early, earlier, I can solo these, uh, but it's nice that I don't have to. Yeah, once I max speed, I can technically do full skips on this thing. Uh, there's literally no reason not to. Uh, in fact, it, full skips are honestly safer. Uh, so it's technically a positive thing to do full skips on this guy. Uh, and plus, it'd be kind of funny. Three speed to go, yeet. Oh! <laughs> no way! That's a thousand feet power! If I got that, if that was the assassin skin, I would have been actually upset. Oh my god, we're just rolling in the feed power. I'm telling you, this is why yard sale was so bad, because I just didn't get things like this. Okay, now we have no room in our vault, because everything in here is dedicated to feed power of that one egg. So once we die in this character, if that l last pet is heal, magic heal, and it doesn't even matter what the third is, it can be savage for all I care. If that's heal, magic heal, we're good to go. I wish, admittedly, I wish that pet was a humanoid egg, because then humanoids have a much higher chance of getting um, heal. But uh, even if it's heal, even if there's no magic heal, I think I'm going to use the rare pet for now and feed to it simply for the fact that it's so much better. Uh, now, if we don't get heal, uh, um, the question becomes, do we wait and see if we get another egg or do we use all the feed power to max two commons fused to uncommon? And that's the question. That's the thing that we kind of got to ask ourselves. Um, I don't know. I don't like the uncertainty of it. Uh, because honestly, it, it, I could just end up getting an uncommon egg or a, another rare egg as soon as I start feeding things. Uh, knowing my luck, that'll probably happen. Uh, either way, I'm gonna go get my last two speed real quick. Uh, I'll probably just cut two until we max it or we die. Another rock dragon, what the hell? Uh, this could give me T10s uh, or just a fucking water robe. Um, but I don't think that's gonna happen. I'm just gonna cut two. Uh, last two speed, and then I'll, uh, see you on the other side. How fucking crazy would it be? Oh, I should start dodging. How crazy would it be if I end up getting a water robe here? Uh, it is a loss of... Oh, how much does water robe give? It's not 13. I think it is 12. Uh, so it's literally not a loss at all. It's just a direct upgrade to Elder. 
I think. Uh, I'm not sure. I, I don't think it gives as low as 10. I think only Cult Rogue gives 10. Uh, we're at nearly 600 fame, which is incredible. Um, it's good to see us... Pro huh. I have no room for this. Um, what? <laughs> I literally have nowhere to put this. Uh, I guess I'm just going to keep it on the character. I could theoretically replace the, um, I could replace the, uh, effigy mark with it and then just keep the effigy mark on hand. Um, okay. Wrong one. If I get one of these on one of the melee PPEs, I'm going to shit my pants. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what to think about this. I didn't expect that at all. I, I unmuted just to talk about getting a fucking pet. Or whatever the hell I talked about. I can't remember at this point. Uh, a corpse died. That's kind of fitting. I'm just going to sit down here. I could go help clear, but uh, I'm going to be a leech. <laughs> okay, that that's really great. Um... So we got Stenos, the mini flying Steno, and FDBA today. Uh, that's kind of that's kind of bloggers. <laughs> now, what are the odds? What are the fucking odds that I also get a water robe? Uh, it's not gonna happen. <laughs> Be really funny if it did. Uh, but Lord Whites are really rare. I don't think I've ever actually had a. FDBA since um since the rework came out. Uh last one came on yeah, last one came on my Paladin PPE and that was before the rework. Um I don't know. Uh I think I've had one water robe. No, it was a leaf hide. I've had a leaf hide. Haven't had any celestial blades. Uh I, anyways, uh this is all just a lovely segue to the fact that I'm about to get a fucking water robe as well. Nope, but fuck it, I'll take it. Um, yeah. <laughs> cool, thanks for that. I'll do the Penarac before I go, uh, vault this. That's why I fucking die to a Penarac and lose the fire battle armor. Gets a, gets an Oreo as well. Oh, this is a Godwall Penarac, okay. If I got an Oreo as well, Jesus Christ. And then, like, my Paladin's gonna be, like, the shittiest class imaginable. Oh, I also wanna... Go do that lab. Probably won't make it to it. Attack. Sweet. 22 to max. We're getting there, guys. We're getting there. T9 staff? Alright. Uh, it's an upgrade, honestly. I'll do the lab. This one just spawned, so it's fresher. Alright. I'm hoping that I also get the door wooden chest so I can get rid of these. I'm honestly just going to keep these on my person uh, until I get one. Uh, any chance early on to do quest chest is really good because it's just potions and maybe equips. Uh, quests are about to reset in about 8 minutes. Let's hope I get door warden and um... <laughs> here, here, here's the move. Door warden, um, effigy, cultist. Uh, that way I can theoretically open up all three. Uh, that'd be kind of poggers. I'm getting kind of close to 800 fame. I could theoretically just go max Vit Wiz in the realm and just kind of hope. And then maybe closer on defense because that'll be, by the time I max that, I'm pretty much there at 800 fame, which will guarantee that I will at least hit five stars on this character. Um, which now is a good time to mention, yeah, I'm in, I'm on episode four of this uh, and I'm on the first character. This might be a really long series, obviously, but uh, it's good to keep in mind that some characters are probably going to be shorter than others. Uh, Wizard's kind of a long max. The melees are probably going to be really short. Uh, I might max... If I get really good attack rolls, I might just max attack and do hauls, depending on my equips, and then just go for it like that. Oh, I just got a perfect spell bomb. No way. Uh, that's never going to happen again. Um... Yeah, I don't know. I might make the melees pretty quick. Uh, melees are rather boring classes to me. They're they have the potential to be the best, but I don't really think I'm gonna like actively go for them. Blue bag, T5 prism sucks a big one. Oh, that's even worse. <laughs> yeah, uh, melees probably gonna be. 
at least hopefully faster characters. Uh, Wizard might be, this might be a really long one depending on how much I go for it. Obviously I want all the characters to be good, uh, but some might just not be as good as others. Uh, about half spell on there, yeah. Um, yard Sale didn't really have any, like, I have the Huntress. Huntress is the only one that I upload that is an actually genuinely good character. The Priest wasn't bad, I hit like 5-8. Got like conduct, uh, T5, lab robe, expo. Is I think my ending set. So it wasn't a bad character. Definitely not an uploadable PPE. I think out of all of them, Huntress was the only uploadable one. Uh, Warrior and Paladin were good, but they were both really short, so I merged them into one uh, video. Oh, um, hey, uh, I'll take another expo. It's 500 feed power. Uh, I'm taking all the feed power I can get, honestly, at this point. Uh, the defense is good. That's 15. That's uh, we're good to go on that front. Uh, bees. Okay, I'll do them. Hey! Shout out to this guy, that's really great. <laughs> hey! <laughs> I really appreciate that, it's really great to see. And I want to show him this. Oh, the red boss. Oh! Pff, that could have been death. Yeah, that's uh, it's really great to see. Uh, that's in general. I'm going to keep saying this for the rest of this series. It's been really great to see all the support in these videos. They really influenced me to keep doing these. Uh, ooh, the perfect spell bombs are really good. Uh, as I said at the beginning, I didn't think it would do this well. Uh, I thought it wouldn't get that many views. Um, so I'm glad to see uh, y'all have proven me wrong. Um, oh, come on. Damn it. I'm kind of hoping that I get a... Um, and I want to show him this. Yeah, this <laughs> this character's... Oh, I'll, I'll do second, yeah. Uh, I'll do second, why not? Um, yeah, we're getting kind of close uh, to halls. We're almost there. Uh, we're also getting relatively close on all of our stats. Let's hope, uh, let's hope for something good here. XAHP or T10. Can this drop T10? I think so. I don't see why not. Uh, I, I don't know. Let's check. We're going to find out. All right. Quests have reset. Oh, we got an ST. Um, I'll keep all these in. Uh, I was going to say I'm going to go vault them, but there's no point. Uh, we're not going to get all of these. Yeah. Uh, let's see. No. Oh, Christ. I ain't going for that. Uh, okay, unwilling, that kind of sucks. Uh, yeah, that, that's bad. Um, that's unfortunate that we didn't get it this time. Uh, I'll replace that with that, honestly. I'll keep the mark on me, and then my entire vault's gonna be dedicated to feed power. I have, <laughs> oh god. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, let's go really quickly, max speed. And then, um,. Let's go max our speed real quick, and then let's go for the last little bit of our, uh, let's go for our staff. Okay, hopefully this Magic Woods is the last of the, um, speed. Uh, yeah, that staff is going to be an issue. Uh, hopefully I just get it in, like, a wine cellar or something, like the next one I do. Uh, crossing my fingers for that so I can at least do hauls. Uh, got about, we're about 20 minutes in at this point. Uh, I might just cut two until I get a staff and literally just sit here and try and get one uh, just depending on how long that takes uh, we might not have time to do cults uh, but we'll see we'll see we'll see at the very least next episode no matter what we're starting cults oh sweet not even not even not even the thing I need awesome <laughs> this guy just said he <laughs> oh that's really great I'm really glad to see that uh, more people are recognizing it um, that makes me happy because uh, people recognize Yard Sale, but it took a while. Um, it took until, like, Red Star for people to recognize it. I think it's the name Puberty just kind of makes it more recognizable. Um, so I think that that's my headcanon on that. Uh, but I'm glad to see it. I'm glad to see that more people are kind of recognizing it. It's kind of gay. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Never mind. I don't care. I don't want your, I don't want your money. I don't want your support. Uh, I, don't, I, don't, I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't want it anyway. This is fine. It doesn't matter. It's fine. Doesn't, doesn't fucking doesn't matter, guys. I, I didn't need him. 
He gave me a few. It's his loss. Haha, -ha, got him. Alright, this is it. This is where we get it. I'm telling you guys. Plan is simple. At least a tier 9 staff. Not Hall's Rex, but it's an upgrade because we've had this tier 8 staff for a long ass time. Sign bag? Not what I need. Get your damage in, get your damage in <laughs> before he moves. Nothing there. <sighs> yeah. Oh well. Paralyze it. Yes, good, 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 good. Doku time? Doku's more feed power. Actually, it's useless because I don't have enough room for it. Mm, <laughs> no! That could have been it. Damn it. So I'm probably not going to have enough time to lead a cult for this episode, uh, which is unfortunate, but I at least want to get the tier uh, 10 staff. Uh, hopefully I can make it to the realm. Uh, let's just see how this goes. Hey, realm closed. Nice. Hopefully, I'll end up getting a better spell from that. Or a better... Uh, rope. Oh, uncommon egg. That's it. That's it. This is going to be my heal magical electric. It's also a good way to test uh, if I can properly pop it. I almost went to go Nexus. That would have been dumb. This is where our staff upgrade ends up being an EP. Or, uh, well, <laughs> EP is technically, technically EP meets Rex. Uh, you could technically use it, um, which would be funny having to EP Malice, which you can do. You can EP Malice. Uh, <laughs> Tezakal's tail would be obviously fantastic, but we'll see. Ah, oh, an upgrade. Finally, still not a Hulse Rex, but it's an upgrade. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> Something we can use. And then with this tier 9, we're gonna go get a Cosmic. Alright, first time trying Dance Phase on this account. Uh, let's go die, because I forgot to get HP bots. 3 is good enough. Gotta get all the damage in. Oh, shit. I get all the damage in so I can go get my cosmic. Nice perfect spell bomb. Yeah. Overall, I don't know. Ah, uh, damn it, we got hit. Oh, well, he got hit. <laughs> wow, glad we got damage on that phase because uh, we ain't getting damage in on this phase. At least not enough. Uh, hopefully, I get something a little bit more than like a whiz pot. Uh, that's what I'm holding out for here. Uh, we might not even get the T10 at the end of this episode, which is really frustrating to think about. I might start next episode with getting the T10. Or with, you know, death. But I don't know, we'll see. We're just going to see how this goes. Oh, someone needs to paralyze it, thank you. Oh, trade challenge. <laughs> Whatever. Let's see how this goes. Gets an ST bag. Nope. Single defense. Oh well, so we didn't end up getting the T3, or, or the uh, T10. But still, defense is nice, 13 to max. Uh, which one am I targeting? I'm targeting right. Right's the one that drops uh, tail. Give me like a fifth white bag from these guys, honestly. That'd be kind of sick. It's not going to happen, but like, if it did, it did. Aw, oh, why it's online. Damn. That's okay. Dude, if I got like a Cutlass, like my night set would be, it would be Cutlass, the, one of the million snakeskin shields I've gotten, Fire Armor Expo. Which is kind of weird to think about. Uh, but unfortunately, my night's probably not going to be that good. Oh, don't drag it away from us, dude. I want to get my zero. Yeah, honestly. And zero. Nice. Okay. Let's go see if we can pop this egg. Uh, let's also check our fame. 1592. Okay, not terrible. Let's go see if we can pop this at all, because if we can, that means we only have to upgrade our pet yard once. We can. It's the pig right there, right? Oh, no! We're close! Close. Um, okay. I'm not going to pour everything into that one just yet. I'll take the chance. Well, I mean, either way, we can upgrade our pet yard and see what the rare is. If the rare is worse, we'll... Still probably not even use that one. We might not. That's a bad idea to pour everything into that one. Uh, unless we end up getting legendary really early. I don't know, I'll see. Either way, thank you all so much for watching this episode. If you have enjoyed, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what I can do better. Let me know what you want to see from this series. 
Uh, next episode, hopefully, is one where we start to do cults, and uh, hopefully we end up getting a lot from that. Uh, we might just get, like, 80 marks and then call it a day. Either way, I'm really excited for how this series has gone so far. Wizard's been a bit of a slow burn, um, but we're making progress. We're start finally starting to get the ball rolling, uh, so hopefully we can end up maxing this. Maybe even get our first character to 8-8, which would be really crazy, considering Yard Sale didn't get 8-8 into, like, Warrior. But we're just going to have to see. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.